Okay, here's a deep defending uh, crossing activity, crossing and finishing, but for the defensive purpose this week. Uh, we have the ball, we open up, it is five against five in the middle with neutrals on the outside. On the outside, there are three zones, okay? So as they look to keep the ball, if there is a lot of pressure on them, they can use zone one, the near zone, as a purpose to keeping possession. So now as he comes here, let's say, boom, uh, we're able to find the ball and we're able to switch it to the other zone one just for possession purposes, okay? The objective for the attack is obviously to score a goal. So if we find it into the middle zone, zone two, this creates an overlap. So as soon as the ball gets played, let's say here, and it goes into zone two, this neutral should already be running, coming around, playing it forward for a cross, okay? As this is happening, the blue team uh, would be defending. We are in a complete zone. The moment the ball goes wide and the overlap is initiated, we go from a zone to man-to-man -man concept in our club. So the near player should pick up a zonal position. He is the only one now that would be in a zonal position. Uh, he's to to basically everything inside of him would go towards the keeper. Everything in or outside of him, he could attack the ball out, but take away the critical area. The other two players here would pick up runs, right away go man to man. Again, we're making contact early, and then we're impeding their run, and then as the ball is served again, we're in a position to make contact late, and then to win the ball out. So the play goes back and forth, uh, 5v5 to goal, when the ball goes wide, and we're able to find this player forward for blue, initiate the overlap, runs in the box, find marks, find marks, find marks, take away the near zone, as the play comes in, we're out and we're defending in a good position to work on individual man marking, as well as near zone, to win the ball up and then step the line up as we move forward.